Oh, anyway. Anyway? Hello. Hi. Welcome. My name is Rotor. This is... That's not my neighbor. Uh, uh, I've gotten... Really heavy papers, please vibes from just what I've seen of this. Let's go. Okay. The doppelgangers you let in don't kill you immediately, but at the end of the run, get a score rank. Sure. So there's no story mode to this yet? The following short film is of attraction of the DDD uh, with educational files. Hello! You're watching a film because you're the new doorman for the building. Your job is to determine whether the person who wants to enter the building is a doppelganger. As everyone knows, doppelgangers have the ability to transform into another person and impersonate them. But some are not too good at it and could generate imperfections. You have to pay close attention to the appearance of your neighbors. Also, remember to fill out the checklist for each neighbor. I can't... I can't. You can't miss any detail because it could mean death for you and your neighbors. This is the structure of your office. Now, we're going to explain how it works. This is the security window. Don't forget to observe very well each individual who approaches. On the right you have your folders with all the data of each neighbor according to the respective floor. Fill out the checklist, take one of these lists in front of you. Receive the documents from this hatch. If you determine the individual is a doppelganger, then allow the isn't a doppelganger, then allow them into the building with these buttons. Otherwise, if you determine that they are in fact a doppelganger, Press the emergency button and call 3312. To communicate with the DDD or any apartment in your building, the telephone is in front of you. Your job is really important to make sure you do it right. So make sure you do it right. Finally, we congratulate the doorman of the month, Henry! It wasn't that he did an excellent job, but he was the only Zora man in the area who didn't get killed by doppelgangers. Be like Henry. But better. Why is that light off? Welcome and congratulations on your new job. Yeah, uh, just uh, just a second, buddy. As you can see on the introductory film, your job is to verify an entry of neighbors. Each day there will be a list of individuals who will request entry. It is possible that there are individuals who will request entry who aren't on the list. In which case you will mark them on the checklist that they are... In which case, oh. also you must verify the ID and the entry request is correct and have a respective DDD list. Oh, don't forget it's also to check expiration. Oh. Remember, it's February 55. I wish you a good look. Oh. Hello, hello. How do you do? J just a second. Do we have someone with ears? I don't think so. Okay. Hmm. 
You got an ID. Question the individual. Who are you saying you are? You're Francis Moses. Wait, is there a... Nope. Francis Moses. Four, three? Ah! Short hair, wears a hat, tired eyes. Oh, okay. Uh, apartment number is 4122. Okay. I got this. I don't got this. Hey, hello, Francis speaking. I'm not expecting any visitors today. Mm, my ears? I spread them out to hear better. You say so, buddy. Am I not on today's list? I think there's an error. I should be on the list. Look at the list again. And then it was three, two. One one, right? Oh no, three one three three one two. Three three one two I didn't let go apparently. That's not my fault. I didn't do it yet, it's not my fault. No contact other day today. A group of agents has been sent to your building. Please wait for the cleaning protocol to run. Well. Ah, oh, hello. Cleaning protocol complete. Yes. You can continue your job now. Goodbye. Bye bye. Oh. We got pointy ears again. Alright, who are you? Entry request. Raftelin? Raftelin? Capuchin. Apartment. Four. Three oh four. Yeah. You know, that's somewhat right. Expiration of 62. Uh, there's a lot of, of information there. 3, 2, 9. Yep, that checks out. Um... Ah, apartment phone number is 4258. Yeah, if you could just, uh, 4258. Just hold on down there. Raftaline. Raftaline speaking. My husband is not at home. Is he back? <laughs> my appearance? <laughs> What's wrong with my ears? <laughs> They're normal human ears. About the fact that you're not 
on the list? Three, three, uh, one, two. Here we go. Two in a row. Cleaning complete. Oh my god. Good afternoon. Nacha Michaelis. Okay, yeah, yeah, that checks out. Why is your head so big? Okay, well, you've got an ID. Your parents checks out. You're not on today's list. Oh, no, wait, you are on today's list. That's my bad. Entry request. Ah, my entry request. Nocha Michaelis. I am a resident of the building. I, I am a resident of the building. I come from my job as a chef. What? As a chef. Did I misread this? Apartment 2-4. Yeah, I just didn't look at that. 2-4. 1346. 1346. 3, 4. I hate this rotary thing because it keeps letting my mouse go out of the screen. 1, 3, 4, 6. Oh my god. One, three, four, six. There we go. Oh. Ostanch is speaking. And my mother is not at home. Whatever. Cool. Perfect. We did it. I think. Hello. Dr. W. After. Okay. <clears throat> Afton, is it? What floor are you on again? 3 1. Maya Stone. You have robust eyebrows. You wear glasses, short hair, round nose, and squared head. 1425. Well, let's see if Miss Stone answers, Mr. Afton. Mm. Ah, my fiance and I are in the apartment right now. We're not expecting any visitors. Huh. <laughs> ah. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. The last thing we need is another mimic. Good afternoon. All right. 
Albert Albertski Peachman. Floor one, apartment two. I am a resident of the building. I come from my job as a shoemaker. Floor one, apartment two. Has a mustache, prominent chin, big nose, big eyebrows, long face. Shoemaker, 6354. 6354. And then, what was the phone number? 2668. I hit the wrong thing. 2668. Let's find out if Peachman is home. Robert Skeep speaking. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, you know what they say. You have an ID. You have the appearance. Hell, you even have an entry request. But there's a problem. You're not on the list. I think there's an error. I should be on the list. Look at the list again. You know what? Let me do that. All right, who's next? Gloria Schmidt, floor two, apartment one. One one five zero, round face, mole on the right cheek, short hair, round nose. If that checks out. 1150, give me that apartment number again. 5123. Arnold speaking. My wife is not home. Is she back? Resident of building apartment is on the apartment is the one on the second floor. Okay, yeah. Checks out, checks out. Checks out. Checks out, checks out. You got your idea, appearance, entry request. Complete. Go on in. Elonis Severets. Sever. Sev I mean, nope. 4956. Your apartment. Floor 1, apartment 4. Yep, yep, that checks out. 4956 and 6996. Celine speaking. My sister is not home. All right. Resident of the building. Job is a model. But check out. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mole on the right. Mm hmm. Small pointed nose. Mm hmm. Slim. Mm hmm. Long. Mm hmm. Has a twin. But her mole is on the. Ooh. Ooh. Wait a second now. Oh, no, 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 I was looking at it. Okay, we're good. We're good. They're both models. They're both models. They're good. You're good. You know what? You're good. Get on inside. Get on inside. Okay, so we've had these two. 
and you, so it's just you we're waiting for. Hello. Wait a second, what? Excuse me. I'm sorry, what? Well, hold on now. Man, just hold on now. There's a problem here. We got, uh... Go for my job as a model. Uh oh. What was their phone number? 6996. What happens if I let you in anyway? Because one of you is a fake. You say so. Uh huh. You say so. You say so. But then who is this? Okay, your face is a little. a little more plump on the bottom. Right? It's not just me. Like, her face is a bit more plump down here than it is up here, right? When do I lose? <laughs> or when does the, the shift end? Whenever all the people on the paper are back? McCoy... McCloy... Rudd boys. Okay. Well, you're on the list. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Four six one one. Resident of the building, come home from doing shopping. Three o three. Three o three. Rudbus. Uh, always wears a hat. Smokes. Yep. Goatee. Mm -hmm. Big nose. Mustache. Four six one one. Apartment four two four two. Steven speaking. My father is not home. All seems to be clear here. I am a resident of the building. I went out to visit my mother. Floor 0101. Lois Stlinski. Three six one five. Yep. Three six. Say one five or five one. Five one. Housewife. Big lips. Mole on the right. Or on the left. Round face. Short hair. Yep, that uh that's that's right. One one five two. Well, who's in home? Roman speaking. My wife and I are in the apartment. No. You're not real. Hello, 
You may continue your job. I think I will. Oh, I know you're not on the list, so it doesn't matter. Alright, who are you? Alf Capuchin. Resident of the building. Job as a lawyer. Apartment 304. 6347. Yeah, that checks out. What was your 4258? I think he's good, if I remember correctly. Because her doppelganger tried to get in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Checks out, checks out. Checks out, checks out. Uh, where's the hat, monocle, prominent mustache, big nose. Big, big nose. I didn't want to open that. Get on inside, big nose. Yup, yup. I did it. Oh. What? Fantastic. Okay, so there are more modes coming. Okay, well. Oh, I didn't get that. The Chester's quiz? Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Anyway. That was your... <laughs> that was... That's not my neighbor. Uh, if you like this one, you can check it out. Link in the description below. It does cost a little bit of money, but there is going to be more to it. Again, very papers pleasy. Um, yeah. It was a fun little game. I uh, hope to see more of it. Keep an eye here. We might check it out again later. Uh, for now, thank you very so much for joining me today. And until next time, I'll see you. Whatever comes next. Bye.